Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to use the rich text builder in Google Sheets to leverage some amazing advantages. Let me demonstrate a few use cases. In the first case, we have a short article on mantis shrimp. Here on the next sheet, we have the data on how to format this piece of article, such as emphasizing keywords using different colors, making the text bold, or adding hyperlinks. Now, let's run this. Here you can see the article has been transformed. You can apply different styles to different text within a single cell. It has added a bunch of hyperlinks as well. Let me show you if that's working. All this can be done very easily using separate formatting rules. In the second demo, we will cherry pick a few items and give them different colors. This approach can be used to find different words in and assign different colors for quick visual segregation. Here I am taking help of a small story for kids involving fruits and vegetables. My goal is to apply color to different objects based on the formatting rule contained in the next sheet. Here in this sheet, I have listed all the objects that I want to find and apply color on them. Now let's run to test this. This has successfully applied the colors to different fruits and vegetables. In the third demo, I want to show you how you can use the rich text builder to create notes full of references. Here I have listed Nobel Prize winners along with the subjects for which Nobel Prizes were awarded. In this sheet, I have listed the winners' names along with their color codes and links to their profiles. Now let's run this. It has done what it's supposed to do. This way you can quickly prepare notes or article with several links and export it to Word documents or any other documents. Spreadsheet lets you do this quickly and efficiently. Now, let's move to the code. But before that, let me show you the references for this. These are the references that I have followed while scripting this. I have attached them in the description below. Let's open the script editor by clicking on extension and then app script. This will open the editor in the browser itself. Here, you can see three top-level functions related to the corresponding demos. All three are calling convert to rich text method and passing two arguments, target range or the range where you want to alter the text, sheet name containing formatting data. We get the target range by chaining methods like this. Then we call the method convert to rich text defined below and pass the target range along with the sheet name that contains formatting data. Coming to convert to rich text, we first grab the value of the target range. Then we call the function to load formatting data from a separate sheet. Get the active spreadsheet, then retrieve the sheet by its given name. Get the range of data in the sheet. Grab the values in the range as a 2D array. Now, assuming the first row contains headers, we create an object for each row mapping headers to corresponding cell content. Return the formatted data. Basically, it will return the data in this format. Now, coming back to the convert to rich text method, initialize a new rich text value with the original cell text. Iterate over each formatting rule that we got from the load formatting data function. Check if the specified run exists in the cell value. Adjust rich text formatting based on rules in the formatting data. Set a hyperlink for the specified run if provided. Apply bold, italic, and color styles to the specified run. Set the modified rich text value to the target cell. In summary, the script takes a cell's text, applies rich text formatting based on rules defined in a separate sheet, and updates the cell with the formatted text. The formatting data includes information about runs, hyperlinks, styles, bold, italic, and colors. That's it. Please read more about it in the references. I will post the link to this spreadsheet in the description. Feel free to try different adaptations of the concept explained above. If you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.